So this is a part two to the Bombi situation. So if you haven't watched part one, link is in the top right hand corner. So let's get it. I was searching on YouTube and I found a video made by Xylence which was showing Bombi's face. I watched this video and it was a short video and it didn't really contain much except that the fact that Xylence got out ratioed and I didn't really believe that that was Bombi's face. But when I looked in the description, I saw a link that said to join the Discord. So I joined the Discord and I went as an undercover agent for you guys. So first of all, this Discord was a pretty big Discord, like it had a lot of members. And this guy from the last video wanted more, so I investigated it. The Discord is quite strange, with some moderators saying that they will give Nitro if people send them selfies. And there seems to be a lot of dodgy dealing, with Zylan offering safeless for gold. So he is leeching off the gang and he's just gaining so much money from this. So for those of you who don't know, Zaylist is basically a concept of if you pay to sign up for it, you won't get stream snapped or targeted by Zylans. And in my last video, Zylan revealed that they have a blacklist for people to snipe, so they also basically have a whitelist to keep people from being sniped. And something seemed off when, when I searched for Bombies on the general text channel, it showed the members of the Zylans is called being angry, angry or mad at Zylan. So does this mean that Silence as followers are either simps or just supportive people. Of course not. After a bit more reading, I discovered that there were still quite a few people hating on Bombies while making inappropriate sexual jokes about her, and that didn't really make me feel comfortable. I'm a minor and a very horny one, but this isn't what I wanted to see in a large Discord like this. I saw people who wanted their pics and saw people who were encouraging silence, so all of this made me think, what was wrong with our fucking community? On the general chat, I even saw Shark's video about Bombi, so people are clearly onto people who are exploiting their actions. I saw people being toxic to Bombies, but I didn't really see any proof of Bombi's photos being leaked. So either Zalin scammed them or sent them privately, but then why would he leak it on YouTube? Overall, this is a very weird server with people making sexual remarks, people asking for pictures of people, and paying for certain memberships and a lot of toxicity. I hope that this is the end of the situation. If there's anything else, I'll make a video and inform you guys. That's pretty much it. See ya.